So first off, a lot of you already know this, but it's a slide I include. What is it that I do? Well, most importantly, I'm mum to gorgeous Matthew and Alice, who you met last night. Uh, Matthew was on the diet for nearly six years. The reason he was on the diet for six years is because I was too scared to take him off after two, but in hindsight, I probably would have tried a week. Knowing what I know now, back then, it's fear that does keep a lot of the families on the diet. And even now when I'm coaching families, if they're saying, oh, I don't want to go off, I'm scared, I'm scared, I will turn around to them and say, listen, you can gently come down, do as your dietitian suggests, give it a try. We can always go back up again if we need to. So on the whole, I've been coaching families for nearly 12 years now because I was doing it for a couple of years before I actually got Matthew's friends off the ground. Uh, obviously, I'm the founder of the, the charity. We've now got branches. We've got Matthew's Friends New Zealand. We've got Matthew's Friends South Africa. As, work, as well as working with a lot of other countries and organisations within those countries, we'll partner up them. Obviously, the obvious one is Charlie Foundation in the States, Keto Kedzik in, in Holland. Um, there's Geordie's Magic Diet in Israel. So we'll link in to the families that are working within that country with the medicals and some of the, the ketogenic support groups so we can all try and keep abreast of what each country is doing and also get the word out regarding the meetings and swap information for the families. And certainly a lot of our booklets have been translated into other languages and being put on other websites. And we're very proud of that fact. If we can help in any way, then we will. Uh, I'm a director of the Matthews Friends Clinics where we treat children and adults. Um, I'm also a trustee for Dravet Syndrome UK, parent representative for the Keychain Professional Advisory Group. I'm on the executive board for the Joint Epilepsy Council for the UK because I believe that not enough is being done or advocated on behalf of complex epilepsy. We do know that for the majority of people with epilepsy, if they take their medication, they can be well controlled, they won't necessarily have side effects, then go on to live a normal life. What about that 30% that it's not controlled for? So I kind of get the soapbox out and jump up and down on behalf of those people because it's those people that we're dealing with all the time. And also I attend the all-party parliamentary groups for epilepsy and I'm an international patron for diets for epilepsy in India. So for the past 12 years, Kitchen Diet has taken over my entire life. And I love this diet. I love, love, love.